My name is Jesse Omok, and welcome back to the C- C- CNT Podcast. I hope you've enjoyed this month of posting of the Team Deep Dives. I hope it's gotten you all ready for the MLB season. I hope you've enjoyed it. The support has been meant so much to me. I know I after the two-year anniversary week, I took a hiatus because I recorded all of these. I had to wait a lot of them. I, I've worked really hard on this, and I really hope you've enjoyed it. And to, I thought, I can't, I can't just post 30 episodes like this. And yesterday, I thought, I always try and do an MLB standings prediction. This is the perfect day. The day right before opening day. I couldn't be more excited. I hope, I know I've been enjoying spring training. I hope all of you have. So, let's get right on into these MLB standings. In the AL East, we have, I have Blue Jays coming in at number one, making playoffs. Yankees coming in at number two, making playoffs. The Rays coming in at number three, making playoffs. The Red Sox not making playoffs at fourth. And the Orioles coming in last, missing out on playoffs yet again. Then in the AL Central, you got I have the Twins winning it by a game over the White Sox. However, both teams will make it. Then the Indians are going to miss out at Thorn. And then Royals and Tigers, you can probably interchange them. I have Royals at fourth, Tigers at fifth, both missing out on playoffs. In the AL West, I have the Astros still winning it, making playoffs. Angels coming in second, making playoffs. Athletics making it, making playoffs as well. Manners at fourth and Rangers at fifth. Now, I have been saying this for the longest time, that the Angels have, will make playoffs. I've been saying it for the longest time. I truly believe it this year. They got some pitching. They got Quintana. I do believe they are going to make it this time. I, I know I say this every year. But I, I, I definitely think the drought ends now. Now, moving on to the NL East. Easily the best division in baseball. I have the Nationals winning it by a game. And then you got making it. Then you got the Mets coming in second and making it. And then the Braves coming in third. Going to make it as well. Then the Phillies coming in fourth. Making playoffs as well. Yep. I have a four teams in the NL East making playoffs. With Marlins coming in fifth. Not making it. NL Central, I have the Cardinals coming in first, making playoffs. The Brewers coming in second, making playoffs. Cubs in third. Pain me to put them there. I do think they're still better than the Reds and the Pirates. Would like them maybe to try and push for a better spot. I don't have them making playoffs, which truly hurts. Reds coming in fourth, not making playoffs. And then Pirates in fifth, not making playoffs. Then the NL West, you got the Pod. I have the Padres winning it by a single game, making playoffs of course, winning the division. Then the Dodgers coming in second, making playoffs of course. Giants in third, D-backs in fourth, and Rockies in fifth. Neither none of those teams are making it. So those are my predictions. Let all I uh, maybe I'll come back at the end of the year see how I did. I really, truly appreciate all of the support over this month. I hope you enjoyed it. I do regret to say I will miss the first Monday of April. I'm just going to be taking a break after doing recording so many episodes. I do truly hope you've enjoyed this month of posting. I hope I'll see you soon. Let's enjoy some MLB games. MLB is back. Can't wait to make even more content. It's obviously better for this podcast during the season. I'm super excited for this year. Thank you all for watching. It means so much to me. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, and I will see you soon.